Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, and with me is my commentary partner, Lee Dixon. And we've got potentially exciting league action coming up on the menu for you. It is Bayern Munich versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek. Good atmosphere here. Everybody looking forward to what should be a really entertaining game. Space on the flank. Perisic with the ball. Read it superbly to take back possession. And so they start at 11 for Bayern. Jerome Boateng starts alongside Niklas Zule at the back. And leading the attack today is the lethal Robert Lewandowski. Martial! The offside flag had to go up, and it did. Yeah, look along the line, look along the line. Interception, a good one by Boateng. But I believe there's been a goal in the Barcelona match. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Barcelona. Six minutes played, 1-0. Cheers again, Alan. Perisic on the move here. And they've won possession again. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Kimmich with it. Oh dear, I think he's left his shooting boots behind in the dressing room. Well, it was well worth the effort. Poor technique, really. Should do better than that. And possession lost, intercepted. Thomas Müller. This attack looks highly promising. Ivan Perisic in the centre. Not all that convincing defensively. And they do like to press whenever they can. Pogba, can they get themselves in front here? Well, good defending, clattered out of there. Corner kick played in. Maguire. And news of a goal in the Marseille match. Alan McAnally can fill us in. It's a goal for Marseille. It's been scored by Dimitri Payet. A lovely goal from the edge of the box that swung into the top corner. 18 minutes played, 1-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Could pick out a teammate. Really good block. Here's Luke Shaw. Martial. Martial! Oh, that's sizzling from Neuer in goal. And he's fired over the corner. Quite the tackle from Thiago. Manchester United were the victors against Milan. How do you think this game will go, Lee? Well, Derek, a decent win, 1-0. Clean sheet to boot, but will they win today? I'm not so sure, it'd be a lot tighter. I'm going for a draw. What a shocking pass, really. And news of a goal in the Schalke match. Alan McAnally with the details. It's a goal for Schalke. 28 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. And dispossessed. Muda. Far from a good pass. This is Robert Lewandowski. Just couldn't keep the ball. Bruno Fernandes. And he's made headway. It's there for him. 
And the opportunity for the opening goal goes begging. Well, the stalemate should have been broken there. It's a real terrible miss. Well, Derek, you can sense the frustration growing from the fans. That lead... And he's broken free. Martial! Well, that is a moment he would like to airbrush from history. Well, he's had an absolute nightmare there. The goal's in front of him. Just hit it. There's been a goal in the match being played at the Stade of Vélodrome. Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Marseille. 38 minutes played. 2-0. Cheers again, Alan. Crossing possibilities. Speculative ball fired to the near post. And this could represent an opportunity for Bayern to nudge in front. They've won the corner. Meta! And the keeper exuding confidence. Yeah, doing his job. Right position, right time. And now Coutinho. Coutinho. And he knows he can do a lot better on the shooting front. Well, how many times has he had that chance in training and scored on that occasion all over the place? Perisic. Here is Joshua Kimmich. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. They might be able to capitalise on the wide position, Bayern. Juan Massa. And Paul Pogba. Now can he deliver accurately? Well, that cross was... Well, as the attacking side, you might dispute it, but offside by a hair. Yeah, spot on from the linesman. Spot on, but he was close. Massa. That is that for the first half. The teams have switched around. Manchester United kicking off the second half here. Here is Fred, Maguire, Paul Pogba. Poor pass under no real pressure. He's given it straight to the opposition. I believe there's been a goal on the LAFC game, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for the visitors, 49 minutes played, 1-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Massa, Fred, Alaba comes up with it, and there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. A real opening now, he had just the goalkeeper to beat, he's got it completely wrongly. Well, he won't be watching that when he gets home tonight on a replay. Here is Fred. Massa. Williams. Fred. Given away by Manchester United. Now, let's see what they can do here. An authoritative challenge. And news of a goal at Anfield. Here's Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Liverpool. 59 minutes played, 3-0. Thanks, Alan. He's got to score! Easy save for David De Gea. Ran it superbly to take back possession. Opportunity to take the lead. Can they slot at home? Possession changes hands, the interception there. Good technique displayed. Ivan Perisic in the centre. Well, he failed to get it away properly. for grabs and the keeper's in trouble well to deny him from point blank range like that brilliant well really really strong goalkeeping spread himself used all of his body really good save and United Marcial he was being very closely marked, but the header not on the target. No, just off target, and the thing is, the defender did his job, and he just couldn't quite get enough of his head on it.
Someone has found the net at Anfield. Who exactly? Alan McInerney. It's another goal for Liverpool. It's been scored by James Milner. A great counter-attack down the right culminated in him heading the ball into the ground and it bounced up into the roof of the net, giving the keeper no chance. 69 minutes played, 4-0. Cheers again, Alan. Martial outthought by his opponent. Promising sequence. Thomas Müller. And there's the feed into the box. And heading it just over the bar. Yeah, he thinks he's in, he thinks he's scored. And he's just over the bar. Well, the pass not finding its target. 15 minutes remaining. Jerome Boateng comes up with the ball. Well, he's not long left. Bayern have to push over that line. The crowd are doing their bit. Thiago. Coutinho. Here is Thiago. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Arsenal game. Alan? It's a goal for Arsenal. 80 minutes played. 3-1. Thanks very much as always, Alan. This is Müller. And the back. throw in to Manchester United Williams Bruno Fernandes Manchester United getting higher and higher up the pitch what can they produce from this position Bruno Fernandes and this could win it and foiled by Boateng And he's fired over the corner. Well, he didn't catch it the way he intended on the volley. No, on volleys, you've got to keep your eye on the ball. And he just wavered a little bit. Not one he'd be looking back on very fondly. And very deftly cut out. Just a couple of minutes left for play. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Maneuvering his way forward. Potentially productive pass from Martial. Superb save, and still they are level. Oh, I love goals at the end of games, but I also love saves like that. Brilliant, brilliant goalkeeping. Here is Joshua Kimmich. Odrio Zola. And the referee says that is all for today.
two great clubs in one great city. It's Manchester, it's City against United, it's live for you on EA TV, coming up now. Hi there, everybody. Martin Tyler and Alan Smith welcoming you to the Etihad Stadium for this highly acclaimed and deeply anticipated Manchester derby with the United fans remembering that famous win that stopped City clinching the league title at their expense back in 2018. And City hoping they do a lot better in this fixture today. Yeah, they certainly will. I mean, this stadium hasn't always been the noisiest, but there's not going to be any problem with the volume here today. It's packed and both sets of fans fully up for it. No time for an extra touch after the tackle, it's out of harm's way. A chance to break away now on the counter. And he could get away here. Surely the keeper stops it, it could be a follow-up now. Well, the goalkeeper now at least can uh, relax a little bit. Uh, he was certainly tested to the full extent of his reflexes just a moment or two earlier. Yeah, I mean, the second save a lot simpler than the first, that's for certain, but great goalkeeping. Strong tackle. David Silva. Oh, they couldn't keep possession, they've given it away. Here's David Silva, taking on a couple, steered through, catching practice indeed for the goalkeeper here from that poor cross. At the Estadio Ceramica for us is Alan McAnally today. Alan, news of a goal, I believe? It's a goal for Liverpool. 30 minutes played, 1-0. Thank you very much, Alan. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there and pass goes straight to the opposition. Leroy Sane. And that will... Peter out that attack, it's the goalkeeper's ball quite easily. But if they're going to do well here at Manchester City, and obviously they hope they'll do well, he could make the difference. Three in his last three games, his teammates will be looking to him again here. And that's a turnover in play. Sane. Taking on the defenders. Towards the front post. Saved by the keeper, he can't hang on to the ball. Maybe the counter-attack is on here. He's through. Martial delivers the ball into the penalty area. Gets in the way of it, the defender. These games, of course, between the Manchester rivals, Alan, in our time, we've seen them go from being formalities for Manchester United to being ultra-competitive derbies where the City revival with the extra money that's come in from their backers makes them uh, not just competitive, at times better than United. Yeah, walking into the stadium these days, you never quite know what's going to happen. Clearly City now on a level footing, I might argue in recent years, on a, on a higher footing than United. Silva. Oh, it's offside. Well, as a striker, you expect to get the benefit there, but he didn't. I think there's been a goal score in the Parc des Princes. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Paris Saint-Germain. 27 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. Thanks, up. Treading it through. Still dangerous here off the goalkeeper. Well, that pass never looked like reaching its target, and they're away with the ball. Listen to the noise as their team recovers possession. Somewhat risky, the defending. And they've cut it out. Alan McAnally, our man reporting from the uh, PSG game. A goal for Paris Saint-Germain. The score is now 1-1. It's run out of play. It's a difficult technique, that. Yeah, you've got to catch those volleys perfectly to do the damage. City bossing this in terms of controlling possession. But I don't think the manager will be happy down there watching this performance. He would have been expecting more. The fans would, and I was. You have to feel that they will step it up sooner or later. Well, it's easy here for the keeper. We've got news from the Schalke match for you from our man on the spot, Alan McAnally. And I believe, Alan, there's been a goal for you to tell us about. It's a second goal for Barcelona. It's been scored by Lionel Messi. He's picked the ball up a full 30 yards out, taking a touch, 
and then hit an unstoppable shot into the top corner. Stunning goal. 37 minutes played. 2-0. Thanks, Alan. And it's the tackle that stops the attack here. Out of harm's way, out for a throw. Well, I guess he was aiming for a teammate, but he certainly didn't find one. Read the intentions. In he goes for the challenge. Here's Laporte. The crowd uh, may be expected a bit more, but it's two added minutes. That's United's free kick. Igalo. Taking on a couple of opponents now. It's not really a way. Poor clearance. Keeper did well to reach it, but he couldn't keep it. Well, we're halfway through. And we haven't yet got a goal to bring to you. Nil-nil at half-time. Setting the ball rolling for the second half, Manchester United. Lindelof. Here's Williams. Squandering possession cheaply, really, with that pass. Quick bit of goal news for you from uh, Alan McAnally from the Villarreal match. It's the second goal for Liverpool. 45 minutes played, 2-0. Eagle eyes, as always, from Alan McAnally. Well, the word average comes to mind about his first half. What do you think, Alan? Room for improvement, I think you could say, from this lad. Had lost the ball. Sane. It's an excellent cross. Super header, narrowly wide. Yeah, the goalie was rooted to the spot there. And some movement from the Manchester United bench. There's going to be a substitution now. Able to intercept here. I think there's been a goal scored in the Parc des Princes. Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Paris Saint-Germain. It's been scored by Neymar. A great counter-attack down the right culminated in him heading the ball into the ground and it bounced up into the roof of the net, giving the keep... Shots on here. Fantastic save. The short route here. Gets his cross in. Goalkeeper opts to punch. It is corner after corner. And here we're going to have a substitution. It seems as though it's... For tactical reasons. Kyle Walker. Leroy Sane. Now they've got the ball. Leroy Sane. Bernardo Silva. Here's the chance to get in the cross. Bernardo Silva. Little piece of interplay between the two. Read the play well. Bernardo Silva. Looking to attack the cross in numbers. The header is off the target. Yeah, it just didn't connect properly. I don't know if it came off his shoulder. Maguire. He's cut it out. Well, the hosts here taking advantage of home advantage with the possession last 15. And you would fancy them to put themselves in the lead pretty soon the way that they're playing. And they are creating some good chances. Good save by the keeper. A dreadful error to take the lead. Really good to blast it goalwards, but it's into the crowd. Yeah, that's not a great one. Penalty at New England. It's a penalty for Bayern Munich. Up to take it, Robert Lewandowski. A slight delay as the ref clears the defenders. Goes for it with a fist. And that's going to be a throw. Not a corner, although some thought otherwise. 
And this is a good opportunity to put the ball into the penalty area now. And the defender has blocked the cross, and he's done it well. We've got news from the... Rodri! Just throwing his body into the way of the shot. Blocked another shot destined for the goal. Saw the direction of the pass. Taking on the defenders. Walker! Super reflexes from the goalkeeper. And in it goes. Here's half a chance. He's got his fingertips to it, and it's over the bar. What has been wave after wave of attack, and the crowd responding to golden opportunity now. Simple save for David De Gea. Apologies to Alan McAnally for actually intervening there. In that game, Barcelona did get a goal. Confirmation for you. And now they're winning 4-0. The defenders managed to get in the way there. Now, this could be a chance for Manchester City to get the lead here from a corner. Well, they want to do the short corner here. The defender really putting his body on the line to stop the cross. Well, there are other options from the bench. He's put in the corner. Not really away from... Kept his concentration, the goalkeeper, and because of that... What's the keeper doing here? Now he wants to take them on. Chance to check in with Alan McAnally. A goal he can tell us about in the Villarreal game. It's a third goal for Liverpool. Ten minutes remain. 3-0. And we're back here again, thanks to Alan McAnally. Clever pass in behind by De Bruyne. And the pass not completed, really. And it will be their throw. Still seven minutes left on the clock. Here's Walker. With his skill, here's a chance to have a run at goal and take the opposition on. Another chance, really. When are we going to see a goal, Alan? I don't know. I mean, with a better technique, the call ahead, he'd have scored there. Bruno Fernandes. That pass never looked like reaching its target, and they're away with the ball. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Ball played to Mendy. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Mendy just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Referee's had a good look and decided from what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Oh, what a chance, but the interception has denied them that. Manchester City fans sensing this is their time to get the winner. It's a risk-taking time for Manchester City in the course of the pursuit of a winning goal. Now, can he cross it? Defender did well to get to it, but hasn't really finished the job. Well, that is the final whistle, and it's finished all square. Well, they're close by the geography of the two clubs and very close out on the pitch today. Well, you could see the intensity of the play from both sets of players and both managers. Nobody wanted to come out of here a loser. So the player that can normally inspire victory didn't quite have that impact today. Well, we've loaded the plaudits on him when he's been scoring this season, but you've got to criticise on this occasion because he was really poor out there. No goal to show in what was a pretty poor draw as well for his side. beyond those in the middle for a throw it's a difficult technique that yeah you've got to catch those volleys perfectly to do the damage 